Here is my cooking system for my sailboat. This is a sea swing stove. It mounts on a bracket that I have on my boat. And I bought this without the uh, stove itself. So I went on the internet and I found a uh, butterfly stove made in, I believe, Indonesia, maybe in, in India. And I'll put uh, references to everything that I bought. The only modification I made was down here where it joins together. It might be a little hard to see in there, but there actually is a rubber washer. Now it's very far away. You know, down here doesn't get very hot. Um, it gets hot up there, but I just put that rubber washer in there so that I wouldn't have metal on metal. Uh, bolted this in and it fits quite well. Uh, I do notice when it's burning that I get a lot of heat out the sides here, so I think I may try to find a little extender to extend this up another uh, half inch, get a little closer, or maybe build some kind of a windshield here to direct the heat up to the pot. The next part of the heating of the stove system is my pot. And I got this off the internet. Let me just move it over here. And the cooking system that I'm using is I like to uh, solo sail, so I don't want to have to worry about cooking uh, and burning things. So what I have is inside here, I have a little uh, cook set that I bought from Walmart. Oops. It's a Stansport Solo One cook set. Sorry, there it is. So what I do is I want to boil water for tea. I also want to cook my meal. And if I open this up, you can see that, oh, it's pretty hot. You can see that I have my meal in there. Uh, this happens to be a Chinese uh, leftovers from last night from my wife's uh, cooking. And so down in here, I have my hot water. Now, the the uh, pot itself is not very high, so I want to get it up off the ground so that I can put two cups of water in so that I can make my tea. Well, here's, uh, here's my big camping stove. It takes more than two cups of water to go in there. So I boil water for tea, and I'm going to go ahead and start doing that. And what does it use as a... Uh, it's a spacer. Sorry, I'm gonna put that down so I get the spacer out. Is I use uh, a steamer uh, that I bought from Walmart. Also, just a little spacer allows the cook pot to stay in the water, but not sinking because that would sink if you put it in water because of the weight. Um, so I can keep two cups of water, and there's markers along the side. Two cups. Boil the water have my hot food, have my cup of tea, probably should put a tea bag in there. And, uh, and cook. Now the advantage of having this top is that I don't get liquid inside. Now notice there's a little hole on top here. There's actually a little plastic handle part that comes here. I took that off because I didn't want to make it into a pressure cooker. You know, I didn't want to have pressure being built up inside, so I just wanted to have a little hole there. The uh, pot itself has a little top on it that kind of holds the heat in, and the system works very well. The nice part is that when you're solo sailing, you can set the system up, turn it on, go outside, pay attention to your sailing. If things get rough and you don't have time to come inside and check on it, it's not going to burn. It's not going to cause any trouble. You could sit there for an hour boiling, and all it's going to do is keep your food hot and boil water as long as you don't run out of any water in the system. So it's handy for the solo sailor who just wants a cup of tea, heat up some stew, or heat up some food. Um, you can also make eggs in this, um, put inside the uh, pan here, um, some butter, and throw in some scrambled eggs. I usually make kind of a scrambled egg omelet, if that makes any sense. Scramble the eggs, throw it in, throw some cheese in, and let it cook. 
It does require some cleaning of the pot afterwards because even with the butter in, it will stick because it's sitting there for such a long time. But for heating up soups and stews and those kind of things, it works great. And again, it all started with the uh, swing, the uh, sea swing stove and kerosene butterfly stove.